Welcome to Avathar's Creator Series. In this tutorial, we are going to introduce you to Avathar's Creator Platform and go over its basic features. We'll then learn how you can use the platform to create an experience for a headphone product and highlight its features. Let's get started. Once you have logged into the Creator Platform, you'll land on the Experiences homepage. You'll find some curated experiences readily available that you can get started with or just use for inspiration. To create a new experience from scratch, click on the New Project button here. The first thing you'll notice is the 3D Viewer, where you can add the 3D asset. To navigate the 3D interface, just use the left mouse click and drag to rotate it. Scroll up or down to zoom into and out of the scene, and use right mouse click and drag to pan. You can check the visor tool here to get an idea of the X, Y and Z axis, and also click on any of the axis icons to quickly go to that view. To add a new model to the scene, click on the import button here. You'll find two tabs here. In the neural render tab, you'll find 3D outputs that were generated from Avatar's incarnate app. And the second tab is where you'll find 3D models that are already added to the platform. You can also upload your own models by clicking on the Upload Object option here. Upload both the GLB and USDZ files and then fill in the product details and submit to load the model. To make the product look more realistic you need to add lights. Head over to the Property tab and locate the Light Settings menu. You can add a light by clicking on the plus icon and choose from a range of light types. Click on the subtract icon to delete the light. You can also choose from a range of preloaded HDRIs to make the model look photorealistic. Now that the setup is done, you can check how the final product looks through the camera in the preview mode. Let's now go back to the edit mode and see how we can animate the headphones. You'll find the timeline at the bottom, where you can animate the properties of the headphones like position, rotation, scale, etc. The first set of keyframes are set at default values. Click on any keyframe to edit the XYZ values and make changes to the model, and delete the keyframe by selecting the delete icon. To move the model directly in the viewing area select it to activate the move tool. You can switch between move, rotate and scale tools, by using the shortcuts listed here on top. Let's move the model closer, by dragging the handles of the move tool. Add a keyframe on the position option to lock in the new position. Switch between the preview and edit mode and set the first view of the model. Once you are happy with the first angle, it's time to create the second view. Let's move the model back a bit and add a keyframe to lock the position. Let's also set the rotation value to zero in the XYZ axis. Scroll the cursor on the timeline to check the animation. Using what we have learned so far, let's add some more animation to the model. This looks good so far. Now let's add some text to make the animation more appealing. Head to the Interaction tab here and locate the text option. Click on the Add Text button to add the first text. Change the text content from here. You can change the font style size and color of the text. You can change the background color by clicking on the Add Color option here and choosing the color you want to. In order to animate the text, scroll down the timeline to find the animation controls for the text. You can animate the text in the same way we did for the model. Let's start by scaling the text slightly in the first frame and adding a key. We'll also change the opacity of the text to zero here. Go ahead on the timeline a bit and scale the model up and also increase the opacity to 1. Next we'll make the text disappear when the headphone model moves to the side. Just add keys on the scale and opacity in the same way we did before. 
You can add more texts and animate it in the same way we have done so far. Let's preview the experience we have made till now. Experiment with different product and text animations to create your own experiences. Here's a preview of the final headphone experience after we've added some more animations to it. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial of the Creator Platform. Be sure to check the next one for more such interesting animations.